YouTube, what it do? It's your boy Rich Eats. And obviously I made it through all the disasters and all the stuff that happened in the last couple videos. But now I'm parked to Saturday and I'm hungry. So it's time to go get us some food and we'll talk a little bit about what's been going on. But pretty much I'm right here in the truck. And there's still more problems though, but we're gonna get all this fixed and put together, people. Empty. I made it. I got the load off. But still drama going on. So let me show you this real quick, then we'll go grab the food. People. All right, so I've been having a lot of problems and issues with tires. And I went and got new tires. These are both. Brand new, brand new, a good tire too. And then this happened. Now what I found out was when I load my trailer up, so when I do put weight on here, it obviously is rubbing against this tire. And that's what's been causing a couple of the tire issues I got. And this one right here is waiting to blow. I don't know if it's the axle or what, but we about to get this shit right because this needs to be lifted up way, way. don't have my truck and they're closed so what I'm gonna do is order straight from the box so let's see how that goes. So back in the truck with Sonix. Now let's see what the chili cheese fries look like. I just got the small because I didn't want to be disappointed. And it's really a small, people. Ooh, burning hot. See the little wrapper comes in. That's great. I like the presentation already. All right, people. There they go. A small order of chili cheese fries. They look good. They smell good. Now, let's see how they taste. All right, people. Here we go. All right, people. Ah, there we go. A better view of them. But so far, I'm liking them. I'm not sure what kind of cheese they used on these. It don't look like shredded cheese, which is surprising because it, it still tastes good, but it doesn't taste great. Oh yeah, people, just for those who didn't know, I forgot to mention, I probably did post it up. I'm gonna post it somewhere on the video. But I am in Miami, Florida. And that's where that Sonic is at. Right across the street from, um, what is that place called? Hard Rock, um, Hard Rock Arena. Yep. 
basically people, I am in Miami, I made it. Y'all saw my loads, my rims, what happened on the trailer, but I got it off. I got all of that fixed. I made it here. Now we got another small little situation. Yeah, right, because now my um my trailer is basically really low for some reason. And when I put weight on the deck, it brings it down to the tires and start rubbing, then the tires start rubbing. That's how I got like that. So I gotta go get that fixed. I don't know if it's the axle or what it is, but we're gonna find out. But yeah, people, I made it. I'm in Miami, first load done. Got the BOL sign somewhere back there. Can't complain. You can complain when you're going through the shit, because our show was complaining. I was hating the world at one point a couple days ago, but I always stay positive. I know there's nothing else you could do but get through whatever situation you're in. It's like if you're in a situation, you gotta figure a way out. Or are you just gonna sit there until time ends or something, until you freaking die or something? No, you gotta figure out how to get out of these situations, get out of them, and keep on going. All right, YouTube, so that was Sonic's Chili Cheese Fries. They're real mediocre. Um, for sure, not the best chili cheese fries I have, far from it. But they, you know, they got, they taste good. Like, I'll go there and order them again, for sure. It's just, it wasn't, you saw, it wasn't really no cheese pull to it. It's like, you know, they don't put their heart into their chili cheese fries, like a lot of other restaurants do. But as far as the chili, the chili was really salty. Like, it was very salty. And the consistency, like the, it wasn't liquidy, so that's what I like. I like it to be a little thick. And the fries, the fries are pretty good, you know. They're kind of similar to McDonald's fries or something like that. Whataburger fries. But, yeah, you can pretty much never go wrong with chili cheese fries. Unless you put single craft cheese slices on there. But other than that, you really can't go wrong, people. And they're decent, but for chili cheese fries, I'm gonna have to hit them with this rating. And I'm gonna keep it real, it was 6-1. I'll give them a 6-1 for their chili cheese fries at Sonic's, people. If you haven't had them, I suggest you try them out. Next time, I'm gonna go try a chili cheese tater tots because I've never had that. I can't even remember the last time I had a tater tot. So, yeah, people. Anyway, that's another review. We back on the road. I'm getting some stuff done. Probably gonna hit the shop. Not probably. I'm gonna have to hit the trailer shop up. Get the trailer completely fixed. Find out what's wrong with the axle or why I keep rubbing. So we'll figure that out. But anyway, people, that's another one. And as always, make sure you like and subscribe. All you gotta do is hit that thumb. Click that bell so you can be notified every time I drop these videos. And as always, people, thanks for watching. Till next time.